Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. Question. How do I connect to a remote queue manager with WebSphere MQ Explorer? This video demonstrates a method for connecting the WebSphere MQ Explorer to a WebSphere MQ version 8 queue manager with basic security settings. More information about setting up a more secure connection can be found in the Red Book Secure Messaging Scenarios in Chapter 9. Currently, the only queue manager that the WebSphere MQ Explorer is connected to is a local queue manager called Local QM. The video now shows the steps to connect to a queue manager on another server called Remote QM. Start a session to the remote server and type DSPMQ to check that the queue manager Remote QM is up and running. Start a Run MQSC session for the queue manager Remote QM. It is a requirement for remote administration that the command server is running. Check the command server to ensure that it is running. This video connects to the queue manager Remote QM over the channel system.admin.svrcon. Check that both the queue manager and the channel are defined. Check that a listener is running for the queue manager and make a note of the port it is using. In this video, the queue manager uses the default port of 1414. Create a channel rule that allows administrative access users the ability to access system.admin.svrcon while still blocking the user nobody. Create a second channel rule that maps the user ID that the WebSphere MQ Explorer connects with to a user ID that is used for authorization on the remote server. In this video, the user ID is mqadmin. End the Run MQSC session and return to your local WebSphere MQ Explorer. Right click Queue Manager in the Navigator view. Select the option to Add Remote Queue Manager. Type the name of the Remote Queue Manager that you want to connect to. This video uses Remote QM. Click Next. Provide the IP address of the remote server and update the port number that the Queue Manager is listening on. Click Next. Click Next. Click the Enable User Identification checkbox. Type the user ID that you want to use for the user identification here. Click Enter Password. Click OK. Click Finish. WebSphere MQ Explorer is now connected to the Queue Manager Remote QM. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.